Hi everybody, this is Irvin and Lily, E&L, the Health Nuts, and here we are with Irvin'sFitness.com, and we are about to do some snowshoeing around Pinecrest Lake, <clears throat> and I'll be doing a little bit of fishing, seeing if I can catch any trout out there, and we'll get a little exercise in, doing some cardio and hike all the way around the lake, so stay tuned and watch this video. All right. All right, everybody, we just finished our snowshoe adventure going around Pinecrest Lake. I did a little bit of fishing, no luck, but it was great, nice, uh, relaxing, and adventurous time. Didn't need the snowshoes, the snow was hard enough to uh, walk over. So I'm gonna show you some stretches that would help you out after doing a snowshoe adventure or even just some hiking. As you stand, uh, go ahead and keep, ground your left foot and bring your right leg into your chest. Now as you hold this leg into your chest, just flex your foot in towards your knee. You could even circle your foot. Or if you need to hold on to a vehicle or a pole or a tree, you could do that too. Okay, so as you keep your leg in, you're focusing on your breath. Keep your shoulders back and down. So notice how my spine is nice and tall. Then we stretch the glute and the hamstring, okay? So then make sure that you do your other leg also. So you're gonna ground your right foot, bring your left leg in shoulders back rotating your foot in each direction so be sure to go to each direction okay so that's a nice little stretch for you just keep that leg in okay so now we're gonna release that leg I'll show you another a nice triangle pose so you can turn your feet to your left side so for you it may be the right but mirror my image you'd be going to your right side arms to a T leg straight turn your left foot out or right foot out to a 90 turn your back leg your heel out arms out to a T Exhale, come over to the side. Rest your forearm to your thigh. Reach up to the sky with your left hand and look up at your thumb. Try to bring your hip and shoulder back. So for me, it's my left hip and shoulder. And my legs stay straight. Press into the ground with the outside of your feet. Keep getting that big stretch in your hamstrings. 
and your low back on your left side and keep breathing breath is very important nice deep inhales and deep exhales okay now we're going to inhale come up exhale lower the arms now let's turn our feet to the other direction keep the legs apart about three feet arms out to a t as we inhale exhale move over to the left lower your arm rest your form to your thigh reach up to the sky with your right hand looking up at your thumb keep your legs straight or you can bring your left arm inside your leg continuing to breathe okay nice big inhale come up exhale lower the arms now here's another good stretch too <clears throat> we're going to turn our feet once again to our right side bring your arms behind you interlace your fingers drop your shoulders back keep your arms straight as you inhale exhale lengthen your torso over your right leg and lift your arms overhead now continue breathing and pinch your shoulder blades close together okay okay if you can't hold your hands behind you like that just rest your arms on the ground or onto your leg Big stretch in the hamstring. Uh -huh. Inhale, come up. Uh -huh. Turn the feet to the other side. So, if you can bring your hands behind you, you may. You have to like have direct light and we on fold your over our leg. But that Keep lifting the arms overhead as you breathe in and out, keeping your legs nice and straight. Each exhale, try to come down a little more. Bring your forehead closer to your shin. Great, now we're going to inhale, bring ourselves up, bring the legs back to center. Okay, now another stretch is great for your quads, and that's holding onto a vehicle or a, or a pole or a tree, bring your hand to your foot. If you'd like, try to bring your left hand to the inside of your foot. This helps to keep your left knee in line with your hip, and just lift that leg, keep your torso up tall, then go ahead and lean, if you can, with a flat back. So this is a dancer pose. As you're relaxing with your breath, you can even reach your arms out in front. As you keep, continue lifting that left leg up. If you're mirroring my image, you may be holding your right leg. But that's okay. Do whichever. You're going to be doing the same thing. Mirroring the image. Inhale, we come up. Exhale, release hands and foot. Let's go to the other side. So, holding the vehicle or hold the tree or a pole. Reach back with the hand and place your hand to the inside of your foot. Bring back your knee. Coming over that leg, you can kind of reach out long over your arm. Continue lifting your leg. Okay. We're going to go ahead and breathe. Nice deep inhale, come up. Exhale, release. Lower the arm, lower your leg. Bring your feet under your hips now. Nice windmill, left and right. Very good, nice unexpected little stretch video after our little adventure. So stay tuned to urbansfitness.com and be able to see more adventure videos that we go out and do.